So you guys, good morning. One pair for video, touch a bit, give David. I beg, share one kilo. I don't tire to defend David. I don't be defend David. Give David, I beg. I won't take defend the video. I won't take defend the video. And I can never unfind the video, but the video I beg. Cheat with caution. Cheat with caution. Cheat with caution. It's 30 bitches right now. She won't kill us. Shalom, guys. Who else has seen another video of this girl and the video on Telegram trending already? Jesus, please. Nigerians, how? Like, we all know they see these videos. So, there's another version, another video trending right now on Telegram that, hey God, I cannot even say it. The video Bola Bigo. Or more, the video they chop. The video they chop waiting get flesh. The video they chop clean American Atlanta models. Hey, Jesus. In my next life, I will be like the video. Hey, hey. Choma cannot even do anything because of they don't use money. It's meant Choma for Adeleke family. I'm telling you the gospel truth. Wait, let me tell you the gist. This girl you are seeing, she goes by the name Gorgeous Doll on Instagram. Her picture and video with the video went viral. Let me show you guys. So, it all started with this picture that went viral from her friend, Pink Native. So, after the... And um, this picture went viral, so later they dropped another video of the video begging, kneeling down, and crying at the same time. Let me show you. You guys can watch it. Look at this on his knees. I'm on my knees. He's crying. Hi, the video. Jesus, our OBO. Look at the picture, and then look at what the girl said. She's calling out roaches. Hey, like this girl opened her mouth and said that Nigerians are roaches, so be cockroach. Hey, God. The video don't bring insult to us from all these, all these BBL girls on Instagram, all these Instagram models claiming white when they are even black. Hi God, the video, the video, the video, please. Can we just be like Whiskey DFC and have peace? Supporting you is war. That's not even all though. Hmm. So this is the intro of the video trending on Telegram. You had the video was first. Do, doing the front balls before he went down and licked the plate. Hi, I wish I can share this video here, but very soon the video will go viral everywhere because it's already on Telegram. They are selling it for five thousand for you to get the video. You pay five thousand, and the guy is cashing out too. Hey, wait! Don't play that video yet. Welcome to Lost TV. This is your home of all daily Nigerian trending entertainment news and gossip you need to see and watch. Yes, we keep you entertained 247. Yes, 247. So just subscribe and press the bell icon to be notified anytime we drop the latest we do concerning your news and trending gist. So roll the video now. Roll it. Let me show you another one that is coming out from Nina the Airlines over the video matter again. Hmm. No be small matter. I guess we all can remember this particular girl that went viral during when Davido was still mourning his son and married to Choma too. Yes, Nina the airlines, Anita, that's her name. Call Anita, may she come to go far away. That's the girl from what she claimed. She said that it was her Davido was talking about in that song. So the girl claimed she was pregnant and later we didn't see any pregnancy or any childbirth, blah, blah, blah. And then the story fed out. Right now she's out again after this video of the video doing with another girl. Let me show you what she wrote. As you can see on your screen, she said, you are going to stop acting like everybody knows that man is married. He's so many people in America never heard of him until his recent album. Or because of drama, he don't even post his wife. So let's like clouds. Why that man never post his wedding and his new babies or post his wife enough for it to be known? You all gotta stop coming for these females. It's getting old. Put some more emphasis on your wife. That's what real respectable husbands do. Hmm. She's kind of right though, but we don't want anything from her. She has done worse than giving us a good advice, but at the same time, she's kind of right. So... Sincerely, I pity this girl. I pity this girl. But at the same time, if the video was broke, she wouldn't be in this marriage. So she's still enjoying. 
I believe she's still enjoying. That's why she's there because she's not a kid. If she's not enjoying the marriage and all the luxury and travel and everything, she would have left just like Israel wife left. So I believe she's enjoying and she's not a kid. So you guys should stop that. That Choma is trying blah blah blah. If I'm Choma, I will not leave or more. I can't leave a man because of cheating. That's my nature. Even me, Sebra is talking. I will cheat. I will cheat on my wife. It sure me die. You guys should know. Every man cheats. No man can say I don't cheat. If you're a guy or a man and you are both 20 years and you are saying that you have not cheated, please come and prove it to us. Just wait. Can we tell? Now you go go in your shop. If your man is not cheating, wait. Let me say this. If your man is not cheating with anyone and you are sure, look where he's Gabriel. It's either he's cheating, smoker, bet Niger addict, or drunkard. Like, whoa, but cheating is a must. All of us, they cheat. Choma, accept your fate, carry your cross. It's not even your cross because the worst is marrying a poor man and the poor man is still cheating. I would rather marry a rich man, let the man cheat because men cheat. So be on advantage. Women, this is advice. Signing out. The video of the video doing those things. I will drop it for you guys. Yeah. I will put the link where you guys can go and watch it. I will post it on some mad websites. Thank you. Hi, guys. So, today I had a day. Okay? And a lot of you guys are commenting... I have it posted today um, because I had a field day. That's how it felt. Like I was just outside just playing sports. Like that's how my mind is like everywhere. Okay. Long story short, your girl went to the club last night. Uh, while I'm at the club, I call Bonita or whatever. We have this spiritual number. You guys know I've been on a spiritual journey. I tag her and I'm like, Bonita, what I did not know. Cause I'm not paying attention. I'm drunk. I'm wearing my little Chanel sunglasses. I'm lit. In the side top box, Apple has started putting pictures up there from your camera roll. And there was a picture of me and DeVito. And this is my friend that I've known for four plus years. Okay. Um, I end up going home, going to sleep. I'm out. Okay. Knocked out. Your girl is tired. I wake up to Bonita and my other friend blowing my phone up. They're like, Courtney, why are all these African people tagging me, talking crazy to me? I'm like, what? So I go look and I see that the picture has been, been posted on a couple of blogs, right? I tell them, y'all, I'm going back to sleep. I'll handle it later because I deal with being posted on the Internet. I've dealt with it before. You ignore it. It don't go nowhere. It gets posted. It's gone in 24 hours. Nobody cares. Okay. So I'm telling them just leave it alone. Now, my friend Bonita and my other friend, they aren't, they've never been in a social media scandal or issue, right? And like I told y'all, Bonita is not to be played with. So she has all these random people on her page, cutting her out, calling her out of her name, just going crazy. So I told her, I said, if you want to DM with people and argue all day, go ahead, but do not post nothing, okay? This man has a fan base the size of the world. He's worldwide, okay? I'm like, do not post nothing on your page. This is what I said, okay? I lay back down, I go back to sleep. I wake up to my phone ringing again, and it's them. They're like, these people are harassing me, da 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 da. I said, look, when I wake up, I will make a statement, I will let them know. My homegirl, I just tagged her in it because the numbers you know, I was calling her what the time was, whatever. Okay, I was out, I was drunk. But my homegirl is not me, has nothing to do with me. That is me in the picture, right? I was going to clarify that. But, of course, because Bonita don't play, she's online defending herself, going back and forth with everybody, okay? And she's like, they want to troll? I'm a troll too. So, mind you, there is a video, okay? that I had sent to my group message, right? It's a group message of three of us, okay? And these are people I've known for a very long time. And it's not funny now. 
but we did laugh about it at one point because the video is dramatic okay i'm not going to speak on the video i'm not going to speak of the context of the video i'm not going to speak of what the video even was about okay but bonita i told her you can dm people all you want to do not post nothing okay i did not give no permission for nothing to be posted at this point i haven't even re i haven't replied i haven't reacted i haven't said nothing my lips are closed your girl asleep because i know if i just put my phone on charge and go to sleep when i wake up i might have a bunch of comments but it would have died down you know that's how it usually works so bonita ends up posting this video it's on there 30 seconds because as soon as i get the notification i call her i'm like why would why would you post that take it down right now immediately i i didn't say you could do that i don't support that why would you do that she's like well they're trolling so i'm trolling and i tell her i said well bonita you might think you're trolling, but what it looks like is that you're inserting yourself more into a situation because i told her all you really had to do was say that's not me in the picture. My homegirl just tagged me because we have a number situation and a phone call type when we're drunk situation, okay? But, of course, Bonita trolling, going back and forth. She posts the video, right? Bonita has never met this man, seen this man, been around this man in any context, okay? At all, right? And I had told her, I said, the picture was one thing. You post in that video opens up a whole nother door that I'm not ready for. Nobody's ready for. I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to talk about it at all. So therefore, why would you do that? And I told you, do not post nothing, okay? Granted, when someone's being attacked on social media and they're not used to it, they'll feel the need to defend themselves. I can give her that. But that video was something personal. It was something emotional that shouldn't have been posted at all i don't support it i don't approve of it and i never gave permission for it to be posted okay so now at this point another friend had commented and i want to apologize on behalf of that she called all the africans wrote and i don't approve of that message either as you can see i did not comment or say anything probably until an hour or two ago okay until the end of the day because I had nothing to say. I'm, I made a mistake. I posted something I didn't intentionally mean to post. And I just wanted it to go away. So at this point, everyone's messaging me. They're talking crazy to me. Come and call me B, H, S, all types of stuff, okay? I did not know that this man was married. Anytime that I was ever around DeVito, it was for one or two things, okay? And it's because I'm either styling him for an event because that's what I do. I also help guys, I style people, okay? Whether it's athletes, whether it's rappers, anyway, I, I'll go to the mall and I'll put you something together, okay? I will. I do that. Or another thing is I would help him with bookings. So whenever he would come into Atlanta, I know all the club owners. I would call around, hey, the Beatles gonna be in town. Do y'all wanna book him for a night? And you know, that's another way that I was able to make money. I would book him somewhere. I would make, of course, a percentage for booking him. And that's it, right? So at this point, I have never seen a wife. Um, I had only ever seen a baby mama, to be honest, ever. And I knew he had multiple baby mamas. But I didn't care because it wasn't my business to ask. I never thought to ask, hey, are you married? Because it, it never crossed my mind. So now I'm being attacked on social media and it's like I'm just being perceived in a way that I don't like because I am not a person who's going to destroy somebody's energy. I'm not going to post something that's embarrassing that I know will hurt somebody's feelings. And I just don't like that because this is a friendship that I've built the last four or five years. OK, we're locked in. We don't really he don't care about me posting. He don't care about me taking pictures because we have nothing to hide. OK, and of course, the media is going to screw stuff up how they want to. But I have been dealing with this all day. Oh, mother. OK, so right now, what I want to say is that I didn't post the video. I didn't give permission for that video to be posted. I do not want to speak on the contents of the video or where it came from or what it was about, because I just don't want to and I don't have to.
period, point blank. Um, I understand my friend Bonita feeling like people were at her. So she started, okay, because she didn't know how to handle the situation. I've had media training before. I know how to go about stuff like that, okay? She does not. You, somebody tag Bonita and something, it's, it's y'all going to go back and forth all day. All day. She don't care, okay? So I'm not mad that she posted the video. I am upset that I specifically said do not post anything. If you want to argue with people in your messages, do it all day. But when that video got posted, it opened up a whole nother door that I myself was not prepared for. And I just don't want to deal with at all. And like I said, I want to say sorry to all the Africans for the roaches comment from a fellow friend who was just on their trolling back. Because you guys were sitting there messaging them them expecting them to say nothing if you got thousands of people on your page talking crazy to you you just gonna sit there and say nothing everyone's not like me everyone's not just gonna let it go okay so i got on here to give you a little summary of what happened today um there might be a part two um me and davido are still friends he understands that i made a mistake i was drunk um he understands that even with the video i didn't have control over that and I made it very clear that I did not want nothing posted. But they had made their own adult decision to do that while I was asleep. Okay? I woke up to this, y'all. So, I just kind of wanted to give a rundown and let you guys know. But, yeah. Like, y'all have to stop harassing me. Okay? Um, I can admit when I'm wrong. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. <laughs> Thank you. I know that in there, Black Mamba. Don't forget, I thank God for my subscribers, my phone, and my sub. If you like, if you comment, if you subscribe, I'll keep thanking God for you. I love you all.